CBS 46 is getting results. Workers who say they put in the hours at the Super Bowl experience and didn't get paid as promised are now getting checks more than a month after the big game. This only after CBS 46 got involved. CBS 46's Yasmina Alston joining us now live to explain what happened after those workers went to the Fulton County District's Attorney's Office today. Yasmina. Well, there are about 20 Super Bowl experience workers at the district attorney's office, and they left with the money that was owed to them by BE staffing. Now, these people were expecting to just come here today for a meeting and were surprised with those checks. What was interesting was that an hour, about an hour before that meeting, we also heard from BE staffing. Needs to pay these workers. You may see some familiar faces. That's because these are a few of the Super Bowl experience workers who've been saying they weren't paid by B staffing who hired them. These people worked and have not been paid. Recently, the Fulton County District Attorney's Office got involved and called a meeting for those employees to speak with investigators about their claims. Those are our investigators with the Fulton County District Attorney's Office. But instead, District Attorney Paul Howard had a different message for them. Got some good news for you. Uh, I've got two lawyers here representing the company that owes you money. So one by one, each employee present was called back to meet with advocates, the district attorney's office, and be staffing. If uh, they believe that they're satisfied, then they can go home. Uh, but if they aren't satisfied, then one of my investigators will interview them today and then we'll make a decision about going forward sometime in the future. I'm very nervous right now. Many say they didn't know what to expect after almost a month of attempts at getting their money. B Staffing did send us another statement denying allegations and that they are fully committed to honoring any financial obligations. They ask employees to provide a claim here if necessary. Somebody walked out with a check! But again, one by one, they came out with smiles and checks. I got my check. Are you satisfied? I'm satisfied. It's what it was supposed to be. I'm told there wasn't much explanation for why the payments were delayed, but despite that, money was issued. I'm very satisfied with what I got. How was it? I mean, how was the process? Um, well, it was kind of scary, but you know, I had to. And again, B staffing denies allegations of not paying workers, even though we witnessed several of them receiving checks today. Now, I've been in communication with a representative for the company, and she says the owner of B staffing is ready to talk and share her side of the story. I'm working on setting up an interview so that we can hear her side of the story. And we'll update you as that happens. For now, live in downtown Atlanta, Yasmina Alston, CBS 46 News.